Hi, my name is Ho Ping. I'm a mother of two and I have a background in physical therapy. Today, I would like to share with you three ways on how to prevent babies from getting a flat head. A question that many new parents often ask about. Plagiocaphaly, also known as misshaped head or flat head. This can happen in uterus or during birth as the baby gets pushed down the narrow passage of the birth canal. It can also happen in the early months in life because the newborn skull bone is often soft, thin and flexible. Plagio carefully often fixes itself as the baby grows, but sometimes may need treatment too. Here, I'd like to share with you three ways on how to prevent your baby from getting a flat head. Number one, try to alternate your baby's head position from left to right when they're sleeping. We are a creature of habit and often have preferences in how we do things. Same with babies too. They often tend to prefer one side over the other. If they like to sleep on the left, make sure we give them some time to sleep on the right too. You can also think about placing them in the opposite end of the cot. For example, if they like to sleep on their left side because there's a window and they can look outside the window, place them on the opposite end of the cot. So in order for them to look out the window, they will have to actively turn their head to the right. Number two, when your baby is awake, practice tummy time. As a newborn, there's not much that the baby can do, so they spend a lot of time on their back. So when they're awake, try and give them some tummy time. Allow them to practice building their neck and back muscles, so eventually they will get strong enough to hold their head up by themselves. You can also place them on their sides, so playing with them on the left hand side or on the right hand side when you're playing. Number three, you probably notice that your baby tends to prefer looking to one side over the other. So if that's the case, be, you know, be mindful and place the rattle on the other side or sing on the other side so your baby will actually turn and look to the opposite side. And they're practicing doing this both sides, left and right. So eventually they're able to turn to both sides comfortably and have less preference from one side to the other. I hope these three tips have given you an idea on how to prevent uh, your baby from getting a flat head. Have a practice, play around and let me know how you go.